Um, I think there's a place in which uh, when we experience stress or trauma, it holds in our bodies. Um, when we sit, it's unnatural to sit in school and have to do this. When you think of a lot of our traditional cultures, which were you learn beside your elders or your mentors, you learn by doing. And so there's, there's, I saw a quote once where it said, you know, indigenous children in school is like taking a fish to a tree to ask it to climb. And I really thought about that because I, I know with my own path, I had a lot of difficulty with that kind of education system. And I see that the education system is changing, you know, th thankfully for, for young people. But there's different methodologies in which we, as Indigenous people, uh, helps us uh, because we have a, a, such intelligence and brilliance within our cultures and our values and, and who we are. Um, but it's about reconnecting to see, to feel that in, in, in some of the activities and especially the place in which if you've been experienced shock or trauma, um, it's disempowering. and. Uh, a lot of the things that connect us to the land are empowering. I mean, science has proven that there are microbes in the soil that help with depression, which is really amazing. It's also shown that, you know, when you walk, uh, I saw a thing recently, I think it was called forest bathing, which kind of made me giggle because it's like, well, duh, go for a walk in the trees or go for a walk in nature and you feel better, you know? And so, I think it's an interesting place that the plant world or the world around us doesn't have an ego. And so there's, there's no, there's no destination point of arrival or even getting it all right with the plant world. And when we connect to nature, it helps us reframe our place in which we've become disembodied or disempowered. Um, and, and really amazing that we get to moments of yesterday, we were out on the land and a rattlesnake, you know, came out, which was thrilling and scary and, powerful for people to whoa because we've got a lot of urban people in this program right now and it's really special you know there are beautiful little birds right now the migrating birds and you know and it's 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 kind of amazing when we have those moments where we can connect and everybody's talking about the birds waking them up early this morning and I think that's a way better sound than um you know the sound of trucks and and fire engines and ambulances and those sort of sirens you know, so there's something about that allows us to go into a deep restful place, you know, and remember where we come from and who we are.